After hearing devastating news that St. Joseph's College would be closing its doors, alumni are coming together to keep their alma mater open. News 18's Kara Lake reports on their multi-million dollar plan. It didn't have to happen this way and that's what we're setting out to prove. Due to financial problems, St. Joseph's College will temporarily close its Rensselaer campus starting in May. The news comes as a bombshell for the Alumni Association Board of Directors, including member Jackie Bradway. We knew that we couldn't just sit by and allow that to happen. So the group is starting a fundraiser to raise $20 million by April 1st. The amount is needed before June 1st to keep the campus from the temporary shutdown. We promoted it through a Facebook page called Involved for Life, and we are moving this week into reaching out to alumni, not on social media. Through emails, phone calls, and letters, so far, $200,000 has been donated. We are thrilled at how well it's been received by the community. Bradway says if their goal is met, the money will be given to the college after changes in leadership. On the board of trustees as well as the administration of the college. If the goal is not reached or there is no change in leadership, donors will receive their money back after May 1st. Bradway says the goal is aggressive, but the fundraising is just the beginning. We need to get interim people in place to lead St. Joe. We need to reverse that decision. We still have to deal with the HLC's um, probation for accreditation. She hopes students can return to school in the fall. After talking to members of the community and other alumni, Bradway says the goal is possible. St. Joseph's College is home to me, as it is to many alumni. And I just couldn't stand by as an alum and allow the board to make this decision without giving it a try. Kiara Lake, News 18.